okay uh, man sent me a message from Canada and showed me a picture of his pack horse which incidentally was really impressive it looked like he had some wooden posts on he was packing and he asked me about my panniards that I came up with if I'd make any changes and I guess after all this time I haven't come up with anything really that I would change these knots are adjustable and they're non they're static line in other words there's no stretch to them at all they're I think climbing rope or something this right here just saves your insanity because if you don't they're just like that all the way down the trail and I like a quiet trail so that solved that this I can undo from my horse and I can drop this buckle and I can just grab a block and because of this small lip here it flips the block and it lands farther away from the mule and then uh, of course that's both sides and then I can I can leave this one right here and buckle it tighter or I can put it in the middle put it in the back depending on if I'm flat ground uphill or downhill and um, of course you know if you're going a short distance I can put one more block right here and throw a hitch on it if I need to if it's flat ground I just lay the block up there till I get where I'm going and I tip it off so you can get five blocks delivered like on the Forest Service they won't let you drive off the road so and you put your salt where nobody can see it so anyway five blocks you can take no sweat on this outfit now the key to it is this is a plastic barrel and uh, I just cut the round part of the barrel out and then bolted this or screwed this 2 by 4 on and then these of course are bolts to make it strong and then the leather is to protect it from the trees and something that worked out really good was to put this latigo strap underneath and uh, this strap I run through the hobble strap between the cinches and it just it just helps the brush factor and keeping it centered I guess and of course it's important that your breast collar has got some play in it but not a whole lot because that's a, that's the, the key to to this back cinch I use that's a mohair back cinch and it's real wide and um, I don't use a crouper or a britchin and that that takes care of that because it's so nice and wide it's you can see underneath there how wide it is but anyway I think it's a pretty handy deal and of course you can see you could haul if you were working for the Forest Service you could haul water or, or uh, gap fuel if you fix up your you got the right size tanks and I think you could even set a propane bottle on each side and one on top so anyway I'm happy with it the way it is I wouldn't make any changes and uh, any questions just get a hold of me but it's pretty simple all right thank you and of course you're gonna hit the like button and then I forgot to tell you you need to like me <laughs> so Deb just make a 360 around old rainbow here and show them what it looks like All right, that's 360 degrees. <laughs> Thanks a lot for getting a hold of me. I sure am proud of that picture you sent. That looks nice.